Hello passengers, welcome back. So I am here at Disney World's Animal Kingdom. Today was not supposed to happen. I was not supposed to be here. I was just supposed to do Universal Studios, but a battle buddy of mine uh, from the Army, I'm guessing 1999, that's when we first met. Um, he messaged me last night and said, hey, I'm also at Disney, you know, here in Orlando. So I haven't seen him since, well, I guess in 2002. So I'm here. I can't wait to meet him and his family. Scott is his name. So let's meet up with them, folks. Hey, Joe, roll that intro. It feels so good to be back inside of Disney Disney World's Animal Kingdom. It has been a little over a month, and I like to get here at least once a month. So being here is uh, brings me to a happy place, and I really enjoy so. I wish you were here with me, but like I said earlier, I didn't plan to be here, so I am heading out. I'm going to find my friend. It is 88 degrees. It's hot. I didn't bring any suntan lotion with me or sun spray. I may have to buy some. Um, I'm going to not miss being at home because it's only 33 degrees at home right now and it's raining. So I am happy. I am here. Today it is uh, Monday time of this recording. Anyway, folks, I'm so excited to be here. Yeah, of course. Okay. All right. You know, I'm seeing people get their photos taken. And this is the first time I've been back where the policy now permits you to take your face mask off during the photos only. So since the park reopened, you had to have your face mask on even during photos. It's so nice to see a face inside of Walt Disney World once again, y'all. I'm so excited. Um, so my friends just messaged. They're over at Asia having lunch. And... Heading that way. So I just crossed into Asia. As soon as I got here, I started hearing some music and what do I see? Take a look. Look at there. There he is. My, my, my. This is Scott. So, he and I were stationed together in Fort Knox, Kentucky. The first and, Yep, 1999. And then I transferred to Korea, or he went to Korea before I did. And as soon as I get there, because I was a desk sergeant in uh, Fort Knox, you became this a guy, desk sergeant again. Oh, wait, and why is that? Do you remember that? Because I right out on the computer yeah and and you were the training nco training nco oh the he, they needed a uh a, a, a desk sergeant so what does he do oh he, he was a desk sergeant do it. he did it already yeah so i did that for a year and a half in korea right after thanks you're welcome yeah thanks you got the puppy dogs like you're okay. i did i did it was awesome <laughs> cali river rapid line is here in front of the gibbons now these gibbons you can hear them still they're hanging out over there Anyway, like I said, this is the line for the uh, Cali River Rapids. The end of the line is right across the way. So, standby line starts there. Cali River Rapids. All right. Look how beautiful Everest is today. My, my, my. Every day she's beautiful. So I'm just walking through. I got stopped because of the Cali River Rapids. They had to get from people from one side of the, uh, the, the spot to the other, and they got the, the uh, rope drop. Anyway, too bad it's not a real rope drop, meaning you know you're getting there first thing in the morning. Anyway, so um, I thought, well, while I'm here, maybe I can hit uh, uh, the beautiful Everest ride. Figure I'd try that. Nope, it's been down all day long. So whatever they're doing in there is uh, not permitting me to ride, and I'm okay with that. I don't have a lot of time anyway, so I think I'm gonna go do just one more thing, head on out of here maybe in another 15, 20 minutes, and uh, meet up with some other people. So 
I really don't want to go. I love it here so very much. I wonder how many years that bike has been there. Is a Yeti. Let's see, I never pay attention. Everest is open. Yes, it's open. It's back open. All right, so this is the standby entrance I kept telling you about. It's a 50 minute line right now. So, what uh, I'm not happy about personally is they got this rope here and I can't watch people. I can't, usually I can go across this bridge, I can watch people as they're going by, I can see everything. Yep, I can't. We'll have to come back here another day. It's nice and hot here. When we opened up the park today, when I got in, it was 88 degrees. It's 90 degrees right now. My, my, my. Lots of people are running. I'm guessing it's because Everest is back open. Now, you are not permitted to run here at Disney World's Animal Kingdom or any of their parks. They will kindly ask them to not run. Yet, you can't stop everybody. They're gonna do what they wanna do. I hear some music. See if I can see, catch them before they pass. See, there's more runners. Not a lot of run, but they're doing it. There they are. That's the band. Right here is a Doug and Russell's Wilderness Explorers Clubhouse. Uh, you can now get caricatures. <laughs> Looks like it's a strolling parking lot as well. But this is normally where the meet and greet is for Doug and Russell. Okay. You know, you get to hang out with them here and uh, obviously they're not doing that right now due to COVID restrictions. But now you can get a caric caricature. All right, so this is new. We got a standby entrance, but this cast member is saying that there's no eating or drinking in the line from her point. So I, I've always been able to take this inside with me. So that's a new rule. Let's go with it. I know it. I'll comply. But today is not a day for me with Everest. I'll find something else I got to do, which is another park. So last time I was here, they had the Raya uh, ice cream, which didn't really look that good. But so I don't think they had the Raya ice cream anymore. They got the Yeti Sunday. Oh, uh, I was telling somebody to get it. Well, not here. So my final thought for today, while I was here at Disney's Animal Kingdom, so my favorite place to come to, I think I've mentioned that every time I'm here. Well, my final thought is this. I was excited to see Scott. I haven't seen him in 20 years. I think you can hear that and feel that in the video that uh, we're doing. I couldn't collect my thought. I still can, I'm still so in awe that I was able to see him. He's one of the favorite people of mine. There's some friends in the army. Um, but don't come to Animal Kingdom when you have a lot of other things to do because this place is so magical and there's so much to do and see that you're going to miss out. Like I feel like I'm missing out. But you know what is awesome? One of the last things that I did was the McCalls. They flew over and I got to see them. I was thinking I was going to miss them. And my goodness, the beauty of a trained bird like those. I just love watching that every time. So. Folks, like I said, if you like this video and others like it, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell for notifications of our next projects. If you don't know where the Traveling Jump Seater is going to be, this week for me, Orlando. We'll see you later. Bye.